thought I was done racing um, 16 years ago and started watching races the last few years and it got me intrigued but it was still felt like I already did that you know <laughs> and when I had the idea of riding to races that I had never done before I'd done it once through a race that was like 10 miles from my house and I just really like the idea of going without a car. I've, I don't own a car anymore, so the idea of racing without a car was really exciting. And uh, so here I am, I'm blogging about it. It's uh, bagotbike.blogspot.com and just letting people come along for the adventure, hopefully. I um, rode from Granby, Mass. It's about 100 miles. And I broke it up. I left Wednesday night and did probably 40, 40, and 30 or 40, 40, and 20, that adds up better. Um, and from there, I was camping mostly the first night I had a host through uh, Warm Showers, which is a great website, look it up, warmshowers.org. And uh, I was just uh, having a little bit of an adventure on the way here. Uh, I went slower than everybody else, I think. <laughs> Um, yeah, it's, it's, I've had a long time off and, and I felt it and I think the bikes are a lot faster and that's not an excuse. I used to be able to handle that, but, um, no, it was, it was really impressive how quickly everybody's going and just like hit root section and just like watch them just sit and pedal and, and go away. But uh, I had a few issues early on dropping a chain, but I don't think that had anything to do with anything I did today. Um, it just meant I was a little bit lonely or a little bit faster. <laughs> and um, I really don't think riding here had any effect on it either. Like Everybody's riding every day. I did three easy days to get here. Um, it's just a matter of uh, I would need to uh, step up my game a bit more to, to get up to closer to riding with you. What's, what's the plan to get home? Um, I'm going to start probably in a couple hours. I probably have time to get a good 50 miles in getting home. So I'll sleep out tonight and then get home sometime tomorrow. Do you have a plan for where you're going to stay or you just got to wing it? No, I, I tend to, when I've done touring, I tend to just wing it and, and find spots. So um, keep it keep it loose and flexible and take it from there. So I get to do a nice easy spin home. <laughs> and I've already eaten most of my food so my trailer's lighter and <laughs> it'll be, uh, hopefully, hopefully the, uh, the wind can start going that way because it was at my back coming out. <laughs>